as we try overtime again. A.J. Allmendinger on the inside. Ty Gibbs on the outside as they race side by side into turn one. Almondinger all the way up the racetrack, almost running Gibbs into the wall. We can see trying to make it three wide. Brandon Jones driving away from him. Seek falling back down. As the fight for second has the 54 of Ty Gibbs in front of Noah Gregson right now. Oh, and around goes a car in the back of the pack. And they got Stefan Parsons in the 45. It is. Getting spun around. Still after, green, though. After a great run for Stefan Parsons, he gets turned around. And we stay green. Down the back stretch and into the back stretch chicane. Almendinger with a six car length advantage right now over Gibbs. And only one car separates Ryan C from Brandon Jones, and that is the eight of Josh Berry, who's between them. Two points will determine potentially who makes it into the next round of the playoffs. Almendinger with a three quarters of a second lead. White flag, one more time around. See, pushing for all he's got, using all of the racetrack. Sieg knows what he has to do. Rod, his dad, on the radio, letting him know he's two spots away from advancing in the playoffs. Well, if he gets to Josh Berry, Josh Berry will be moving out of the way because he is coming fast. Almendinger still with almost a second lead over Gibbs for the race lead. Remember, Josh Berry gets by the 19. That'll slow the 19 down, and then the 39 will be right there. Josh Berry. In the eights, he's got to the back of the 19. Now, they're on the big track for the final time. Almendinger looking to make it four in a row at Charlotte. And can Brandon Jones hang on to this final spot for the playoffs through the backstretch chicane for the final time for the 19? And A.J. Allmendinger announced he's going cup racing full time next year. He is still undefeated at Charlotte in the Xfinity Series. He's going to win again at the Robo. Two points will separate Brandon Jones and Ryan Seed. Great job. Dinger's house, baby. Dinger's house. Let's go! A.J. Allmendinger. That makes it back-to-back -back races as well. He won a week ago at Talladega. And now four straight here at the Roval. Think of how impressive that is. The track is so, I know he's fast, but so many things can go wrong. Undefeated at the Roval. 